My dad was a strong, independent man in his late 50s. My dad provided for the family by commercial fishing and subsistence activities in the village of Imonic. It's amazing how things can change in the blink of an eye. I was in my late teens playing a video game in the living room. He was at the stove stirring a pot of soup. Out of the corner of my eye, I saw him lose balance while he was stirring. He started sweating profusely. I had a gut feeling that something was wrong. I went up to him and asked him what was wrong. He said he was fine, but his speech was slurred, and it looked like his left side of his face was lopsided. I alerted my mom, and we got him to the clinic. He was in a stretcher and waiting for the medevac to arrive. My dad had a stroke. The stroke had weakened his left side of the body. My family and I were unsure of what the future held. After his stroke, he lived in Anchorage with my sister for a few months. He took better care of himself by eating healthier and taking care of his personal hygiene. He worked on his exercises daily to strengthen the left side of his body. He got a cane to help him walk. He used a medication box to remind him to take his medication daily. Because of his determination, he was able to move back to Imanic and live with his family. I would like others to recognize the signs of a stroke and know that the person may not realize that they have had a stroke. Use fast to remember the warning signs. Face, ask the person to smile. Does one side of the face droop? Arms, ask the person to raise both arms. Does one arm droop downward? Speech, ask the person to repeat a simple phrase. Is their speech slurred or strange? Time. If you observe any of these signs, call 911 immediately. If given within three hours of the first symptom, there is a medication that may reduce long-term disability for the most common type of stroke. What I have learned from my dad is if an unexpected health issue arises, you don't have to let it knock you down. You can rely on your inner strength while adjusting to a physical disability. Responding immediately can help the person even better in their recovery.